Hi ladies and gentlemen, good morning or good evening to everyone. Today's topic is query and subquery in DB2. What is a query? Query represents a result table or it is a component of certain SQL statements. And what are subqueries? Subqueries are nested select statements. Subquery enable a user to base the search criteria of one select on the result of another select statement. It is always part of a predicate. And what is a predicate? Predicate is conditional expression which we write with the where clause. So this is a predicate. And in the purple color there is main query. And in the yellow color it is subquery. And what is syntax? First we write main query and then uh, means predicate where operand operator okay means operator can be equal to less than less than greater to okay and then we write subquery subquery can appear in the predicate of other subquery this is called nested subquery and the nesting is possible up to 15 levels uncorrelated subquery usually subquery execute only once and it is executed first and the value written by subquery will be used for main query. This kind of subquery is called as uncorrelated subquery. For example, the following query list the employee who get more than the average salary of their department. Like there is EAMPS table. So this is a, there is a salary column, SEL column. So it will calculate the average salary from the column which will be 31,734 so less than this number uh, means all the employee with whose salary is less than this number will be displayed in our result table <coughs> and second example is to retrieve second maximum salary from EMPS table like this is our main query select max cell from EMPS where salary is less than means there is subquery select max cell from EMPS like maximum salary is 56,000 and then so it our result will be 43,000 like this is our employee table so like first in greater salary is maximum salary is 56 so it will uh, return the 43,000 in the result table and to retrieve the third maximum salary from EMPS table so for that it is main main query and then this subquery and this and uh, and this is nested subquery so uh, nested subquery will return 56,000 and uh, and then 43,000 and then main query will return the in less than 43,000 maximum salary means what will be the answer 21,000 <clears> and what is minimum salary in the EMPS table so for that we need to write select app name salary from EMPS where salary equal to select min mean function we need to use from the EMPS so it will return the 18,670 <coughs> means first it select the minimum salary means first it will execute the subquery and after that it will means fetch the, the, the result and it will display the app name and salary of the employee and then employee app name means it will display employee app name and uh, correlated subquery means we say it co synchronized query okay it is a subquery that uses value from the outer query okay like this is our outer query and this is our inner query so we use the value of the outer query first okay and top to it will be top to down approach means from the outer query to inner query okay first select star from employee it will means pick all all the data of this table like one two three six and seven and then in the uh, subquery 
there is like uh, it will check it department eid equal to department employee eid so what it will do means there is two loop means you have you have you have read, read the like uh, nested loop in the c language c plus plus java or in any other language so what is it means uh, it is nested loop first like it will pick the one first row it will pick the first row and then it will check the in department table and it will check the one okay and then it will check with, with this uh, another d2 and uh, d2 department also one so it is uh, check there it is true so uh, what it will do it will write the one a and then daily and then it will check the second uh, row so it will check the like two employee id it is not matching and then it will check with the second row of the department id department table so it is matching so it will write like two b and unni and then it will pick the another row of the employee table six so it will check with the six six it is not equal so it will not write and it will check the another row of this uh, uh, until it is finished means until employee table is finished then it will check the seven seven it is not matching so it will not write this so our result of this query will be this only okay and uh, th that's all from my side thank you for watching please subscribe the channel and hit the like